you know, today I don't really feel like doing a face video with my overexposed. You guys don't know overexposes by now. That's where I bitch rant and moan about car prices that went up for no apparent reason or the hype of cars. And for the record, if I say it's overexposed, it's overexposed. So do not tell me that it's not overexposed. Because with these, I usually help you guys, if you have certain cards, to sell them once you have them in your possession or if you already have them locked up in a box, in a deck box, in a safe. I don't know where you keep your cards, your binders or something. When you find these cards, you can sell them. And I know I have sold stuff already. I have sold four Jura Gatos for 20 apiece. I have sold the Red Eye Stone for 40. And now the next card on this list is Chivalry. If you guys don't know Chivalry, it is from Duelist Revolution. It is an ultra rare and ultimate rare card. Activate only during your battle phase when the effect of an opponent's effect monster is activated. Negate the effect and destroy that card. It is a counter trap card. Now, the only thing I can think of this card is really good for is Cosmos. Thanks to Lentheo. He pointed this out to me. This card went up in price. I didn't know because usually I do my, I look at prices and stuff online. And he pointed this out to me asking why this card was so high up. And then it's like, the only thing is really Cosmos. Anything like Honest. I know y'all don't play against no Black Wing decks unless you're playing against locals, people. No offense to you guys to play Black Wings. Or whatever with colutes and stuff. That's the only thing that I can think of. That's an effect monster that triggers. And uh, then again, ritual beasts activate in the battle phase when they're tagging out and stuff to dodge attacks. But over that, it's like I don't understand why this card went up. Don't tell me Cosmos is, is like did it. Now we all established that Cosmos is good in the ARG format. That has been proven by Jeff. That has been proven by. Alex Vanson and Just Boyfriend Max. They all topped with the deck and then one other random person that topped with it too. And then secretly you guys did not know that Jeff Jones would have topped the ARG 25k but I have heard that ARG decided not to do top 64. Apparently it was on their site that it was supposed to be top 64 for the 25k and then they decided last minute to change it to top 32 and then Jeff got 36. That's all I've been hearing online. But anyway, chivalry. Why is this so much? This is, I'm, by the way, I'm on TCG Play now. If you look at eBay and stuff, now this is the complete list on eBay. You still see this as fives and sevens and stuff like that, or even ones. But why, when you look at here on TCG Player, why is this card $20? Now, that's not even talking about the alternate rare version of it. It's like $23 is the high. I just don't understand. Other than Cosmos and then some like cards that activate in the battle phase. Why does this card go up in price? It did not need to go up. I see no purpose. We don't even know how the format will shape for Cosmos in the Konami format. Hell, I'd be damned if they surprised to change the ban list after Toronto or something. Because hell, I'm going to Dallas and I don't want to play in that format. Or what we have right now. I'm just saying. So, tell me what you guys think. If you have any of these cards, sell them why you can and let me know what you guys think overall and I hope you guys have a wonderful what's today Thursday Thursday and I'll see you guys later bye Catch me if you can.